Hi, I'm Taffy, and I like wearing wigs. Why? My real hair is green. It's lovely, but it's also very fine, very straight, very fucked up. Because I bleach it myself, and that's bad. If it's bad for your hair, you're gonna end up with this much. This is all I got. So I like wearing wigs. Last year, I went to AliExpress and I placed my first order for synthetic wigs. And I got five lovely, eh, so okay, long, natural colored wigs. Some were hits, some were misses. But during that process, I learned things. I learned a lot of things about what makes an acceptable wig. About a month ago, I put my learning into practice and I placed another order for wigs. They arrived last week, the week before, and I'm gonna try them on, show you. Now with the last lot, I feel like I only just trimmed the lace off, I, I, not even all of them, before trying them on. And then I feel like I was like, oh, with a little bit of styling, this one might look really nice. So I feel like I did them, you know, maybe a little bit of a disservice by doing that. This time, I've gone through, I've styled my wigs, I've chopped things, I've concealed things, there's been some razoring, some plucking, all of that, to try and get these wigs looking as well, as good as I could get them before doing all of this. I wanted to give them a fair go. I mean, in this process, right, this is only, this is only, yeah, uh, half of what I have, uh, yeah. So, you know, I, I've, I've, I've gone to town. I've tried my best. So anyway, here are my five cheap AliExpress wigs. Yay, okay, let's go. I'm gonna try them on. First, well, see, I've, I've, I've done some French braiding. You know, not my best work, but you get that on the big jobs. Let me just pin the little ends out of the way. Okay, wig cap time. Get all those little green fluffy wefts out of the way. There we go. Butterfly, bold, yay. This is my first wig. Yay, pretty, pink. This is the Noble Hair African American 12 inches black ombre pink fashion style loose wavy hair synthetic lace front wigs for black women. All the pictures on here are pretty cute. I looked, oh look that parting looks quite good. That's fine. There's uh, actually you can see the inside. Ah, See this? It's probably my least favorite of the bunch. Sadly. I actually I'm going to show you this. The color is exquisite. The pink the pink is beautiful baby, baby flamingo with little bits of sort of apricot, peach, bits that are so pale they're almost lilac. Like the colour is, the colour's real good. I mean, look, it's lovely. I'll show you the inside. There are no clips on the inside, which is a sad thing. It does have lace down the parting. Unfortunately, no lace around the rest of the hairline. Sad thing. Also, this construction, and obviously some of the shorter areas have just gone straight for the pink instead of using the ombre. That's, that's always a bad sign. I don't love that. Yeah, and the construction, not great. I mean, sure, I uh, might have been a little bit rough on her while I was styling, but like, look, this track has come undone. That is not ideal. There was another one somewhere that I tried sewing back on. That was harder than I expected it was gonna be. Anyway, I'm gonna try this on, I'll show you what she looks like. So, the fit is okay. Give her a quick brush. I've taken a lot of the volume out of the bottom, but there's still a lot there. It's pretty cute, it's pretty curly. 12 inches though, I've gotta be honest, it's probably not the ideal length. Like, especially for me, because I've got a big moon potato face. Something a little bit longer, is maybe a little bit more flattering. So like the 14 inches is probably a better fit for me in the future. But like it's so cute and yeah, I mean, it doesn't really go with my makeup today, does it? But pink is cute. Yeah, I mean, oh, get out of my Oh, mm. like it's cute, it's really cute. Uh, there's all that, but you know, Oh, that hairline. That hairline doll. Woof. So this was 43.73 New Zealand dollars. Which is um right up there in price. And honestly, uh like it's great. The hair's great. The hair like the hair is such a beautiful colour. 
but I think this sort of thing, mm, no, unforgivable. But it, it, like it is cute. A little bit scratchy? Yeah, I'm feeling that. I should have known from the picture that showed the inside. I should have known. I, I saw it and I ignored it because I was like, oh, short, pink, pretty, yes. I want me one of those. <sighs> Next time I'm gonna try a bit harder. I don't know what else to say about this really. Like, the color's so beautiful. And you know, there's lace down the parting, which is great, but you know. See that? That's not ideal. You don't want that. So, uh, yeah, th this one was my least favorite, even though it's actually pretty, pretty cute. Okay, next one. All right, this is the next one. This is the Element Straight Synthetic Hair Lace Front 13 Star 4, don't know what that means. Part Bob Wig 14 Inches Wig, Wigs for Black Women 7 Colors Ombre Hair Choice Cosplay Wig. Right? Oh, there's a video that you can watch. I'm not gonna watch that. Real photos, hand weaving lace part like your real skin. Oh, that's cool, cool. Classic middle part, yeah, natural, real. Okay, comfortable, breathable. Oh, you can see the tracks around the side. Right, I'm gonna show you the inside. So this is, this is her there. Yeah. The color, it's stunning, boygundy. On the inside, we have one, two, three clippies. We've got lace that goes all the way around the front. It's not the deepest lace in the world, but it goes all the way back up the part. Uh, unfortunately, the construction of the back is just that. So there are one or two tracks that are starting to come a bit loose. Again, that could be on me because I'm rough. I'm rough with these ladies when I uh, have been styling them. Also, thing that I hate, when you order an ombre wig and the ombre, <sighs> Stops is like only the very top layer because all the rest of it is red the whole way down, which we don't we don't love. But uh, I'm gonna put this on and show you what I mean. Oh, you've balls it up already, mate. Right. Quick brush. Now this one's made out of um, uh, yakky hair fibers, so it's got. Uh, if I can show you. So I don't know if you can see that, but it's ever so slightly some of you. It's ever so slightly crimped. You really can't see that. Uh, so this actually may be a better choice for a black woman because I think uh, having the, the the yakky texture is more believable. Maybe. So let's have a look at the hairline. Don't don't judge me too harshly on, oh, I managed to give myself a bald spot. But like here, oh, lovely, ombre, dark roots, beautiful. And then you go, uh, uh-oh, yeah, look at that. <sighs> Which I don't love. I mean, it's okay, I get as a cost-saving measure on it. But it really, at the back, I mean, I look, if I swizzle this bit out of the way, it's like, oh. Uh, None of that's convincing, is it? I, I, I don't know. I don't know what you can see. It's behind me. But um, yeah. So I like the texture. I like the color. It's got clips and everything. It's uh, it's not uncomfortable. So the whole uh, shorter at the back thing, longer at the front. Is it cool? Is it? Can I talk to your manager? <sighs> that sort of haircut. I don't know. I've never had a haircut like this before. I've tried to make it a bit more normal by razoring and all that shit and the cap on this one it's a little bit smaller than the rest so I, I mean I was wearing it for a bit the other day and was constantly having to you know, pull it back down because every time I was like raising my eyebrow it, it would travel backwards I could probably fix that by clipping it on properly um, but also I don't know I, I, I wouldn't have thought I've got a huge melon Maybe I do. Maybe my head is, is abnormally large. And so that's why that's happening. The colour's cute. It's very pretty. Yeah, I mean, three and a half stars, I guess. But it's, again, the colour's cool. But the whole, like that, that, uh, I'm not into that. You can't be doing that. So, you know, 
really look at the pictures on the website, look for the ones of it inside out. If you can see tracks that are obviously like, we didn't bother with the ombre back for most of the, most of what's happening behind, it's a warning sign, you know. Go for, go for something else. I, how much was this one? See this one's like 44.30, I mean same price as, around the same price as the first one. This does come in lots of colours though, so there's that. And, and the burgundy is really pretty. Great colour. But, uh, yeah. There's some things that aren't perfect about it. But it's okay. Okay. Looks kinda cool. Looks kinda cool, but yeah, it's, um... Yeah, she's a bit itchy, and also, look, it's just, it's... She's trying to leave, she's trying to leave my face! Three and a half. It's cool, it's a fine wig, but also... You can do better. Uh, let's move along. Now this next one is the cheapest one of all that I've got. This pretty lady. 34 New Zealand dollars. Sick. Okay. This is the Soku Synthetic Lace Front Wigs Natural Wave Short Bob Wig. Natural Black Shoulder Length Deep Invisible Side Part Wigs for Women. What do the pictures look like? I don't know, a model that's... Oh, I wouldn't have chosen that mannequin, personally, but that's fine. Interior construction, looking decent, that's fine, I can see that. Cool. Here she is here, that's the back, that's the front, inside out, nice deep parting. Not that generous with the lace. As, as you can see, there are three clips, there are three clips. The ombre goes halfway down the head, which is further than the red one. Actually, my husband was like, it's got orange bits in it. I'm like, no. I mean, it's warm. There's some warm, warm moments. Warm, blah, moments. And the top is, it's actually kind of a warm brown. Does it look like it here? No, it kind of looks black in that light. That's fine. It's not. I'm going to check her on. Now, side part goes way over there. <laughs> oh, oh. There's so much, there's so much space! Let's give it a quick brush. So that's this one. One doesn't want to toot one's own horn, but I think this looks nice. Not too shiny. Not too, I mean, I, I have hacked. Hacked and hacked and hacked. Um, could I do with a bit more styling with some heat? Maybe. That's the one thing I haven't done with these, done any heat styling. I've just, uh, <laughs> raised things. But like, damn. Does this look good or what? Fuck! Look at me! Right, there's the back of my head. Uh, obviously I'll, I'll see when I come to editing what this looks like. Feels like there's lots of room in there for my melon. It's not as scratchy as the last two. And the hair's lovely. It's, it's sitting pretty good. Looks pretty natural. Uh, ombre goes all the way down here. Oh, looks great. So you can, I mean, if you wanted to, one could style it. In a pony or something like that. But yeah, I mean, it's, it's super flattering. I think the pink one, the 12 inches, a little bit short. This was a, did it even say if it was 14 inches? I think so. Yep, 14 inches. Which I think is a really great, like just hitting the shoulders sort of, like it's just a cool chilled out length that I like. All my last wigs, they're all very long. Lovely to have beautiful, long, thick, curly hair for a day or whenever. But uh, I feel like they're impractical. I mean, my, my hair's like this length and I never wear it down because it annoys me. But I can tuck it behind my ears and it looks fine-ish. Uh, don't come for me. Pretty blonde taffy. Na 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 na. Pretty blonde, Tabby. Yes. Yeah. Now I I don't know. I I think this is cool. This is a nice. I like this. I like this a lot. Very wearable. <sighs> this guy though. I mean, it's not a painting. It, it's a print. It came with the house. The old owners of the house used to have this hanging above their mantelpiece. And the real estate agent was like. Yeah, I mean, we'll, we'll leave any of the furniture and shit that you want. And I was like, we're keeping this! We're keeping this guy! He's my favourite. Best channel that came with the house. Wonderful. 
when you wear wigs, you, you just sort of can't stop like being like, ugh. Look at me, I'm so pretty. I'm blonde, I've got great, lovely, beachy waves. I don't know, you tell me. How convincing is this? I feel like it's kind of convincing. But you can see what's happening. I think this looks cool. I think this is a cool wig. Put it on your wish list, think about it. Like with all of these, I've done, like, it, this isn't what it looked like when it came straight out of the box. I've, I've hacked, I've slashed. I feel like I've extolled the virtues of, of this for long enough. So I'm going to take it off and show you what else I got. Mm. Next up, we have this sexy little number. Oh, oh man, oh, so pretty. Dance, LC, buy strap. No, don't, no, I, we don't need to do it in a stupid accent, dude. Let's just, let's just read it like a normal. Okay, shh, shh. Buy straight hair, cosplay wig, 99J, sliver. I feel like some of these AliExpress stores could really think about investing in a good native English speaker proofreader for some of this because, you know, if someone's looking up silver wig, they're not going to find it because this is a sliver wig. Right, anyway. Buy straight hair cosplay wig 99J sliver grey blonde brown 16 inches 150% density synthetic hair wigs. And this one's 39 87 New Zealand dollars. So let's have a look. I gotta be honest, this one has the silkiest, like it's so shiny. I don't, maybe I should have baby powder. I don't know, like it's fine. But it's, oh, silky, beautiful. Right, inside. So here we have the construction. We've got one, two, three clippity wibbities. Looks like the ombre is only concentrated around the top, which makes me a bit sad, but it does go a whole lot further back than what was happening with the, the red straight one. Parting, looks good, lace, yeah, it's fine. And I'm gonna chuck her on. Brush, 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 all day long. Brush, 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 we're lacing this so I'm gonna brush it. Gonna make it shiny. Something, something, turban, tiny. That's, if you know what that's from, you are fucking old. There's no shame in liking 90s Adam Sandler. Is there? Okay, so it's another one that's you know short at the back, so call the manager. It was very, very blunt when I got it, like just straight chop chop chop, like sick of tears. That's, that's how I I don't know. That's how I garden. I don't know about you, man. The color, like the hair. It's quite I feel is it quite fine? It's kind of fine compared to the other ones, maybe because it's so straight, but it is so so silky. And yeah, it could do with some baby powdering or, um, what else do people do? Like soaking in a bucket of fabric softener. I've seen people do that with good results. Uh, the color is, um, it's a very cool gray. It's a very purplish blue gray, which I'm very much here for. I think that's very pretty. That's, what does the back look like? I don't know, can you tell that the ombre only sort of goes up to like there? Hopefully not. I've done a, a lot of hacking away to try and make these ends look a little less, um, just, just straight scissored. Scissored? Like, this is great. I love the colour. Do I want, do I want to be wearing, like, dead straight hair? I don't know. That's, that's where my natural hair just tends towards boring, dead, straight. But if it's something you're into, this is a nice one. All the prices for all of these are very much within, sort of, within $10. Which, actually, the slightly cheaper ones, I feel, perform better. Have performed better, for me. Like, with AliExpress, you know, with everything in life, but... Particularly with AliExpress, you do get what you pay for. So if you go real bargain basement, $10 wig, it's not gonna have that much lace. It's, it's made, you know, they skimp on the clips or the constructions. Something like... Just, Splash out an extra ten dollars, man. Don't don't be so stingy. But I like this. It is. It's really silky. The hair feels super nice. Cap size. Average, I guess. So average fits me. The red one, I think, tended small, but it's cute. It's pretty. The grey. Man, I love the grey. If only my real hair was going grey in such a pretty fashion. Cause my real hair's going grey in a Particularly ugly sort of way. Okay. Yeah, so that's this. This is a very pretty wig. I like it. Okay. Last one. Now, I do have a video 
on my channel. It's here just before this one. And it's where I styled this. Oh, my ginger nut thing. Let me tell you about this one, please. So this is my red wig. This is beautiful. This is the Joy and Beauty 14 inch short. Curly heat resistant hair, orange hand tied daily makeup. Synthetic lace front wig for women, party wigs. Pictures of it. Yeah, and it looks good. Pretty. Pretty. Are there any pictures of the inside? There aren't. So I took a real risk with this one. This one's only $38. Man, this one was good buy. Okay, so here she is. Pretty. Lovely ginger colour. Inside. Look. Solid. Damn. The construction on this one. Mwah! Here for it. I like it a lot. Look how much lace there is. Luxury! I think the only thing is that there's no clip at the back. But there are three at the front. One for there, one for there. One, one's way back. It's, I don't know if it'll sit back there, which makes things hard if you're wearing a wig cap. Like it be. Maybe if you're wearing one of the wig caps that are like made out of... Oh, this one's all ripped and fucked up, but you know, maybe it's for use with the wig cap that's got holes in it. Okay, uh, I'm gonna try her on. I'm gonna show you what I'm in. Quick brush. I thought I cut out so much of the volume. Damn, I could do more. And there you have it. I know, a pretty ginger. So this, it's very silky, it's lovely. I mean, with all of these, I spent upwards of an hour on each one with my razor, just trying to, you know, razor out some of the excess volume because this came with a lot of volume. Holy oh, shit. But yeah, I've, I've got a video where I, I showed how I styled this from, you know, when, it, when they come out of the bag, they don't look like this. Might try them on, go like, oh, that's, disappointing. No, no, get yourself some snippies, get yourself some concealer and a razor and just play with them until they look like how you want them to look. So here's the back of this one. We haven't done that much stuff on the back. Maybe it needs more. I shouldn't talk too much while facing the other way. It probably doesn't help, does it? Maybe this one could use a bit of heat styling like up the top and shit because there's some slightly weird and wonky curls. But this is very thick. There's so much hair there. It is lovely. It's silky. Is it too shiny? Probably still a little bit shiny. But like, that's fixable. I like how the part sits. I like this little cowlick situation. I could do more styling on this. I've got to be honest. I felt like I did heaps, but it could handle more being taken out of like the, the volume. But that's like with all of them actually. I, I could, you can sit there with your razor and, and just do this for days until things finally get as natural looking as possible. But I think this looks cool, man. Like there's no, this is the only one that's uh, not sort of an ombre, um, which is bold for me, but then it also means that you don't get the thing like with all the other ones where it's like half of the hair is ombre and the other half, no. So I really like this. I think this is, I think this is cool, man. I think the colors are really pretty. I mean, I've never had my hair this color before deliberately. It's, it's certainly been this, color because you know as i said i bleach my own hair and sometimes it doesn't work out the way you want it to okay so there's my five new wigs that's pretty exciting eh only like one and a half that was a little bit disappointing but on the whole i feel like i took what i've learned and i applied that knowledge and i came out on top if you want to be a good cunt tell me in the comments which one you think i look prettiest and if you say none of them, you can go and fuck off. I don't want to know. In summation, you get what you pay for. The photos of the wig inside out is the most important thing on the whole page. Like I'd say, spend that little bit extra to get one that's really good. The most expensive ones in this lot were actually the most disappointing, which is a sad thing. But also, you know, these are were all sort of 35 to 45 dollars, right? The ones that are like 25 are gonna be rough. Spend that little bit extra and you're probably gonna get something that is just better. You could say that about everything in the world. So that's me. I'm, I've been taffy and you've watched me play with some wigs, I guess. I hope it's been entertaining and informative. Thanks, thanks for hanging out. It's been stunning. <laughs> Okay, okay. Bye, love you. Bye, 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 bye.
classic. What? <laughs> you say that? Fuck it out. She's a super queen. Super queen. Ba 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 ba. What? What she want? Uh huh. Tabby's wearing a wig. Tabby's wearing a wig. Tabby's wearing a wig. Tabby's blonde and pretty. Tabby's pretty. Tabby's so pretty. Look how pretty I am. Yum yum yum. Bob. 